Hello folks, my name is Mike Cannon, Party Advisor for Building Engineering Group. And today we're going to do a short video on how to use MD5 checksum in Communication Manager. MD5 is an algorithm used to verify the data integrity of a file. Today we download more and larger files from both support.avaya.com and from PLDS. So it's extremely important that we test the data integrity of those files before we load them into our software. The MD5 checksum for file is a 128-bit value that really looks something like a fingerprint per file. There is a very, very small possibility of getting two identical checksums of two different files, but it's next to nil. Again, this feature does a great job of testing the data integrity of those files. Today, we're going to demo how to test it in Communication Manager Linux. So we're going to download a service pack from PLDS or we've already downloaded a service pack from PLDS, put it in our home FTP pub directory, and then we're going to run the MD5 checksum to ensure it's a good file. So the first thing I'm going to do is go into PLDS, and we're going to find the file that I downloaded. So I'm going to scroll down to CM5.2.1 service pack 3, and I'm going to select the More button. And when I select More under that, I'll see I have my MD5 checksum. At this point, what you want to do is you either want to physically copy it down or you want to copy and paste it, or you're going to have this open while you're in the CM Linux and so you can do a stare and compare. Because what we're going to do is match this and check the integrity of the file we downloaded. Okay, as you can see, we're in the Linux shell of CM because that's what I'm going to use as my Linux. Uh, I've already gone through the web pages and downloaded the service pack that will be in here that we'll look at. So the first thing we're going to do is I want to see what directory I'm in. So again, I like to use the PWD command. So I'm in VaraHome Defty. I need to change my directory where that, to where that file's at. So I'm going to change my directory to VaraHome FTP pub. So I type PWD again to check, make sure we're in the correct directory, and we are. I type ls-l. And that file, 021.016.4.18250, is the file we're going to check the data integrity on. So I'm going to type md5sum in the file name. As you can see, it generates the md5 checksum value. And I'm going to compare what's there, starting with 4711, ending with 5679b, with what I had copied from PLDS, which I posted in that callout. And it matches. So basically, we've tested the integrity of this file. And the file is a good file, so now we can go forward and actually unpack and activate this service pack. So as long as you know your directory, the same command can be used for ISOs and other files in Linux. Thank you for your time today. We welcome comments, questions, and feedback at mentoradvai.com or on Twitter at avimentor. For more details or related information, please visit support.avai.com. Again, thank you for choosing Avaya.